Hello everyone, this is Easy from mslumiblog.com and here are 10 cool features on Windows 10 Mobile that are not available on Windows Phone 8.1. So uh, the first cool feature we're going to take a look at is the notification center. Um, on my left is Windows Phone 8.1. Here I have uh, Windows 10 Mobile running build 10.5.12. Uh, the notification action center looks identical, but really when you look closer, there are some functional differences here. For instance, on 8.1, you have one row of action buttons. You have Wi-Fi. These are interchangeable, customizable, rather. And uh, the all settings is at the bottom right there. And here, instead, we have an expand on Windows 10 Mobile. So you can actually expand to additional rows of action buttons there. So uh, that is one feature on Windows 10 Mobile. That's not available on uh, Windows 8.1. Also, uh, notifications, you have the option to expand your notifications here. For instance, if it's more than a line, whereas on Windows 10 or Windows 8.1 rather, you just have one line and you cannot expand that. So that is a welcome feature. Click stop, one of my best features. Uh, would be smart dialing which is finally here on Windows 10 mobile so smart dialing means you can use the uh, dial pad to have straight access to your phone book so for instance I can type in AT and it searches and shows you all the contacts so rather on Windows 8.1 you can you would have actually have to go to your address book to find the contact you're looking for there is no smart dialing on windows 8.1 and windows 10 you have a nice feature here where you can drop down your dial pad or bring it back up that's another nice feature next up is you can see um let's go to settings here and customization of the start screen so here with personalization and you go to start you can see the differences you can actually now choose to make your uh, live tiles transparent you can actually choose how transparent they are and uh, where well, you do not have that option on windows phone 8.1 so that is a welcome addition you can make it really uh, solid as you can see there just reduce it a bit make it transparent and you can see the obvious changes here and there you have it with Windows 10 mobile you have more colors I'll show you in a bit here so um, on Windows 8.1 you have Mm, you have about 20 different color options, 21 rather, 21 different color options. Whereas on Windows 10 Mobile, you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 3, 7 times 8. You have 58 options. So that's more than double uh, the color options you have on Windows 10 Mobile. So. That is one other difference between the two OS's. Uh, you now have the option to actually launch applications directly from the store. The only option you have is to view and it takes you to the app list, then you can launch the application. Well, the new cool feature on Windows 10 Mobile is once it's done installing and uh, downloading and installing, you can just click on the uh, launch, which is the open, and it opens directly from the store. So that is another cool feature. Another cool feature on Windows 10 Mobile that's not available on Windows Phone 8.1 is tech, uh, speech to text. So you can just use this. Messages and just do a text speech. This is really convenient. 
Um, I'm trying to reach you back. Thanks for calling. So that is a nice uh, feature in Windows 10 that's not available. The uh, speech to text is not available on uh, Windows 8.1. Then another feature we can look at is another cool feature is the um, the new cursor here, where you can use to move the enhanced keyboard. The keyboard is really enhanced in Windows 10 Mobile, so you can see you can move uh, the precision here with this mini joystick on keyboard is really nice. Whereas on uh, Windows 8.1, Windows 8.1, you have to actually use your hand to move stuff around. As you can see there, you actually have to grab the cursor and move it. So with this new joystick and the keyboard, it's more uh, more precise. And when you hold on the uh, Windows logo here a five inch screen device like this once you hold it down it brings the screen down so it makes it easier for you to access make it accessible and to take it back up just click on top whereas on uh, windows 8.1 you do not have that option putting down the windows capacitive button actually doesn't do anything so that's a nice uh, addition to have Another feature we're going to look at is um, replying to Excuse me, boss. You have a text message. Messages here. You can reply to text messages directly from the action center. So if you get a message, you can just type in there and reply. You know, whereas on Windows 8.1, you do not have that option. You have to actually go into the text message app. But with Windows 10 Mobile, you can reply directly from the notification center so that is one cool feature stop uh, we'll go to settings notifications so you can actually choose an app and you can choose if you want to keep notifications of that app private whereas on windows 8.1 you do not have that option um, if you get a notification, it's open text like this, but on Windows 10 Mobile, we should do a quick demo. I'm going to turn on private notifications for text messages. And I'm going to lock my phone. I'm going to send... Send a random text message. Excuse me, boss. You have a text message. As you can see, the message says private. No one can see who's sending you a message. And you actually have to unlock your phone to see who's sending you a message. Whereas on Windows Phone 8.1, you do not have that option. So uh, this and the last, uh, let's see. Now the last cool feature I'm going to show you would be GIFs. So like I said, uh, Windows 10 Mobile supports GIF files. You can actually view GIF files on your Windows 10, whereas on, on top here I have Windows Phone 8.1. Um, GIF is not supported on Windows Phone 8.1. So if you, for instance, use Cinemagraph to create a, a really cool GIF file, and you would not be able to view it unless you go into the Cinemagraph um, application to actually view what you created. But whereas on Windows 10 Mobile, you can create uh, a Cinemagraph animation, save it to your gallery, and you can actually view your animation from the gallery. As you can see here, this is uh, a GIF file being supported on Windows 10 Mobile. So that's, one, that's my last uh, cool feature. I'd like to demo to you guys. Obviously, more features are coming. Um, that shows how to work to make this OS really nice. I'm not even going to talk about Android and uh, iOS apps uh, being easy to port them over. I do have a bunch of uh, 
Android apps I did port over to Windows Phone, so that's a few of them, but you know, they're not polished yet. But yeah, that is a look at um, some of the cool features on Windows 10 Mobile so far. More are coming compared to Windows Phone 8.1. Thanks for watching. Bye.